what lessons did your parents teach you that you now know are wrong? Hashtag unlearn. Oh, yay. Uh, says that. Says that. I didn't, I didn't add that in. It says that. Uh, okay. 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 Now, I want to deal with this. No, 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 no. Because <laughs> my dad watches the podcast. Yeah, 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 so, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I want to deal with this in a real respectful way. Okay. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give you a thesis. And then if we follow the thesis, you'll understand everything I'm saying without me having to tell you my whole life. Okay. <laughs> Nature predicates culture. Culture sets standards. Standards execute protocols. I'll say that one more time. Nature predicates culture. Culture is what sets standards. Mm-hmm. And your standards execute your life protocols, work protocols, mm-hmm. okay. protocols. Okay. Yeah. So for a lot of our parents, there was a sense of where they need to get to. Mm-hmm. And sometimes when you're focused on where you need to get to, you maybe aren't as thorough within the why you need to get there. Okay? So you can think that success might be university, marriage, family, house, boom. Makes sense? But a lot of those things are achieved within uh, a, a small space within your lifetime. Then you've got all this other time. Mm. And my projection of life, love, whatever at 25, wasn't the same as 30, won't be the same at 35, won't be the same at 40, won't be the same as 45. So then you cannot make permanent decisions based off of temporary moments. Otherwise you'll tie or attach yourself to a suit that was made for a 14 year old and you're a 40 year old man Mm. and you're looking hella crazy. (laughs) <laughs> but this is the only suit you know not that fits but it's the only suit you know how to wear right so there are some things that do, do, make sense that's good, that's good. And, I, and I think obviously because it's a good analogy on the fly bro, I do that? But, but because and because <laughs> of our community a lot of what our parents dealt with was under duress right do you understand what I'm saying? Like it, it wasn't. That's why maybe some of our punishment systems seemed a little harsher or more severe yeah. than other cultural communities. Yeah. Because they're playing with why the boundaries. Do you understand what I'm saying? Oh, interesting. More in terms of like what everything. the way the culture is everything interacting with them. Everything. The- My grandmother couldn't walk home or go home by yeah, herself yeah, yeah, at yeah. certain times of night. She was a midwife. Right. You know my dad the other day, so if no, 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 within five minutes. My 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 dad the other day told me a story, just like randomly out of the blue. At dinner, he was like, Yeah, you know, I got jumped one time in the seventies on my home. And I was like, You didn't mention that. And he's like, Yeah, but it just happened to London, it's what it was. And he's like, I remember getting slashed with a bottle and just like I was bleeding out and I just stood sit on this bench, I went like head and I was like, Sorry, what? Like if that happened to me, that would be the most traumatic moment of my life. Like, hands down. And he was sort of like, Yeah, and I forgot about that. And it's like, oh, but yeah, we'd that, also be holding a vigil for you because you you'd be there for all the smoke. Our generation is different. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. There are certain things that they learn to accept because they're like, I need to survive. Yeah. Our manifesto is, I'm not here to survive. I'm here to thrive. Yeah. So we will, we will be far more abrasive mm. about taking what we want mm. rather than maybe in a moment where our elders came in, they were like, I'll wait to be given. Does that make sense? Yeah. And so I think it's also why. What, oh, oh, sorry, 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 no, sorry, no, sorry, no. Sorry, 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 sorry. I also think that's why we're maybe creatives because we want to feel the freedom to do what we want to do, mm. and then we'll take it to market. Mm. Does that make what, sense? What's going to happen? I'd argue, maybe I suppose that like my dad's getting jumped in the seventies. Our, our parents going through what they're going through is the reason that we we uh, have the innate sense of like, I will thrive. Because, because they, they did the surviving 100%. bit to a point that pushed the, the bar just enough that now it's like, I haven't really felt much. Uh, truthfully, I haven't felt loads of oppression in my life. And I'm, I'm mixed race, I'm very light skinned, so I've got that like going for me if you want. The but, intrinsic investment I think that our parents gave us because we're very blessed that our parents spoke to us. So in terms of that question, that what that means to someone else, the list could be as long as my arm. For me, I really have to think what was it? Because there are no points where it was 
so bad. I'm like, oh, I just need to. Mm. We, you're gonna go through seasons and cycles. Makes sense. Um, but when I look at it as what I call my parents' iOS update, because that's what we should be. We're our parents, but with all the bug fixes. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, we have all of them, but there's some things that we can't get over ourselves. Yeah, yeah. Like, and I said this to you in a previous conversation. I'm like, I was able to stop feeling away about my dad on the basis that I understood. Okay, if he's the iPhone one, I'm the 14. I can. I'm built to run at a faster rate than him. I'm built to work more efficiently than him. I'm meant to have the bug fixes, but fundamentally, in my 14 model that looks sick, it's everything that the one was. Yeah. So I think, yeah, you kind of got to just, you know, know within yourself. 